hey guys welcome back hope you're doing great happy new year to you all so today i'm going to be talking about some of the things a lot of africans are going through here in abroad if you're new to my channel a big welcome my name is Bella Good. here we do a little bit of everything and if you want to be among those who is enjoying the goodies that is coming from this channel please don't forget to subscribe to this channel also turn on notification bell so you can get notified whenever there's a video so this video is basically for people who live in Africa so if you live in Africa and you have family abroad so these are the things that your family members are passing through in abroad so a lot of Africans who lives abroad they are passing through a lot so if you don't know I'm not your sister I'm not your family member so there's no reason for me to lie to you so if you base in Africa please find time to check on your family members who base abroad because Africans who base abroad a lot of them are suffering a lot of them are into depression a lot of them are lonely they need somebody to encourage them. They need somebody to talk to. They need somebody to share what they are passing through with. If you're based in Africa and you have family here abroad, please find time to check on them. Please don't abandon your family members who lives abroad. Because some of them, because of the situation, the shame, they hardly speak up. They need your support. They need your love. They need your encouragement. And also, it's time for a lot of families who live in Africa, they should stop this habit of pressurizing the members of their family in terms of bringing money. If you have family abroad and he or she tells you, I don't have money, please believe them. Because a lot of people are having problems, are going into depression, pain because of their families in Africa. So if your family member tells you that I don't have money, please believe them because they don't have. A lot of people are not working. A lot of people are in the streets. They hardly pay their bills. They hardly feed themselves because the pressure that some people get from their parents or their family members from Africa is putting them in pain. A lot of people only check on their family members when they need help. Either when they want to pay their children's school fees or they want to pay their rent or they want to start a business. That is the only time they take their phone to call their family members who live abroad. That is wrong. Check on your family members because your family members who base abroad, a lot of them are lonely. They need to speak with somebody. Stop the habit of calling them whenever you need help. Is wrong africans should stop this mentality it's totally wrong stop the habit of carrying your responsibility to your younger one because he or she based abroad so families should stop this mindset of since he or she went to abroad they've not done anything they don't have a car they don't have a house stop comparing your family members who base abroad with other people because some people are going through a lot which you don't know. Comparing them with other people is not going to help them. Instead, it's going to worsen their situation. Stop prejudicing your family members who base abroad because they don't have a lot to offer. Most of you only check on your family members who base abroad whenever you need help. This is when you know you have uh, a family member. You have my sister, daughter is there. My brother's son is there. No. Please find time to check on your family members because people who base abroad, a lot of them are suffering. They don't have a lot to offer. Coming to abroad is not a guarantee that they must be rich. No. Because there are a lot of people who base in Africa who are doing more better than people who base abroad. You are in Africa. And there are a lot of people who are richer than you as well. So if you think it's the same, use yourself as an example. There are rich people in Africa. Why are you not rich? So that is how it is in diaspora. So stop prejudicing. Stop comparing them with others. Try to check on them. Try to talk to them. When was the last time you called your family members to ask 
What have you eaten? What did you eat today? What did you do today? What is troubling you? When was the last time? And also you auntie, uncle, mother, father, sister, brother. So when your sister or your brother, your son or your daughter or your uncle's daughter or your uncle's son, when he or she was in Africa, you were the one who was helping her or him. But immediately they moved to another man's land, which is abroad. You transfer all your responsibility to them. You now see them like your own bank. You call them whenever you need help. You don't know what they are passing through. All you need is money. And immediately they tell you they don't have money. You start having grudges with them. You start doing things to hurt them. A lot of people who base abroad are having a lot of issues today because of what? Because they didn't send money to their parents or their family members in Africa. They are having issues in different ways. So it's time for we to stop this. Because a lot of people who base abroad are going through a lot. They need love from family members. For you to know, if you live in Africa, you have more opportunities than people who live abroad. You have families around you. If you want to talk to somebody, you can easily talk to one or two people close relatives but people who live abroad they don't have families around them they hardly see people to communicate with they don't have friends they don't have good colleagues like they are lonely they hardly have help if you live in africa and you're earning 200,000 naira let me say it in nigeria currency you're earning 200,000 naira you can easily employ and house help who can help you to take care of your kids or do the house chores but somebody who based abroad hardly have such opportunity even though you're receiving nothing less than 500,000 naira nigerian currency you can get a maid but if you are in africa africa and you receive 200,000 naira you can easily hire a maid and pay the maid monthly but in europe you can't do that even though you have five kids, you are going to take care of them all by yourself. So people who live abroad are going through a lot. They are suffering, they are passing through depression, pain, and a lot of them are lonely. They need love from, from their parents. They need love from their family members, it's not all about money. Don't call your family members who base abroad whenever you need money. Also, a lot of people who base abroad are scared to express how they feel on social media because of their family members who base in Africa. They are scared to post their pictures. They are scared to do things that they like on social media because they don't want to put themselves into trouble. Because immediately they post their pictures, you see somebody will call you and please, I need money. And when you say you don't have money, they start telling you that everything that you're wearing on that picture you posted last night is 500 euro. They start calculating. From there, you start having issues with the family. So please, if you're based in Africa, please stop the pressure. Stop the negative energy because it's not helping your family members who base in abroad check on them stop comparing them with others stop telling them this one has this this one has that you've been in abroad for many years you've not achieved anything stop saying those words to them because a lot of people who base abroad they are not clocking money from anywhere they suffer for their money they struggle to pay their bills they struggle to eat some people are living in the streets some people are beggars they stand on the street to beg before they can eat so if you have family members who base abroad please stop the pressure and call them check on them encourage them pray for them they need your support they need your support to push on a lot of people who base abroad are suffering they love to go back home but because of the family members what they are going to say to them 
they are ashamed to go back home they are scared to go back home because most family members are going to laugh at them they are going to say a lot of negative things to them so they prefer to stay here abroad and suffer so if you're a family member you base in africa check on your family member that base abroad check on them time to time a lot of people check on celebrities instead of checking on their family members because of they have grudges with their family members due to he did not send them money he preferred to check on celebrities instead of checking on their family members stop telling lies just to extract money because immediately you lie to them telling them that i'm sick i'm in a sick bed and you know you are not in a sick bed immediately you are sending that your family member to a sick bed too because he or she will not be fine immediately you pass that information so stop the negative energies and stop the lies stop the energy of bring money bring money bring money find time to check on your family members who base abroad so that will bring us to the end of this video hope you enjoyed watching please share your thoughts in the comment section let me know your thoughts about this topic and i'll see you in my next one bye guys i dare you to fix me